smoked salmon scrambled eggs. Very, very simple, really easy to do. First thing I'd say though, is get some really nice smoked salmon, right? Not the really greasy, fatty stuff. You'll end up with a much better flavor, much better quality salmon. We all know how to do toast, but for me, I mean, sourdough is really good for smoked salmon and scrambled eggs. Just a little bit more chewy, it's got a bit more texture to it. The salmon is quite fatty, it's got big flavors and it's strong. Scrambled eggs, I mean, we're gonna put butter and cream in it. So it's quite rich, so you need something to counterbalance that. Heavily done toast, perfect. Slice of sourdough under the grill. Now for the scrambled eggs, I'm gonna use three eggs, okay? Three eggs per person. It sounds like quite a lot, but it's gonna be a proper healthy portion, all right? And by healthy, I mean big. Whisk them together. Now here, I've got a saucepan on a gentle heat. I'm gonna put in that a couple of knobs of butter. Just gonna let that slowly melt down. Toast, I can smell it. So that's the color that I want. I want those little bits of dark, tingy bits on the outside, all right? That helps cut through the richness of this scrambled eggs. Flip it over, other side. Now the trick to egg cookery isn't about hard and fast cookery. You cook them nice and slow. The slower the heat, the easier it is for you to be in control of it. And I'm just stirring, nice and slow, nice and gentle, and that butter that's in there will sit into those eggs. And at this point, just as they're beginning to firm, this is when I season it. Pinch of salt, a nice pinch of cracked black pepper. A little bit of texture, a little bit of crunch and bite. And you can see the eggs just beginning to firm up. Now with scrambled eggs, you wanna cook them to the point just before you think they're ready. Eggs are almost there. And at this point, just when it's really nice and rich, I'm gonna put in Another little knob of butter, and a splash of double cream. Take it off the heat, and stir in the cream and the butter, and just let that residual heat from the eggs and the pan melt everything together, and it makes it super rich, super amazing. Toast, done. Nice, dark brown. I love it, that kind of bittersweet flavor that you get from sourdough, where it's been toasted like that really crispy, crunchy. When it's hot like that, I'm just gonna take a little bit of butter. I'm not even gonna spread it. Just leave the butter just to melt into the toast. And whilst that's gently mixing together, I'm gonna chop a few chives just to go on the top. Chives, scrambled egg, smoked salmon, and sourdough, some melted butter on it. I mean, it's pretty much an ultimate Sunday morning breakfast, this. Final last little stir together. The toast, push the butter. Didn't even have to spread it, look. Just melted beautifully into that crispy, slightly bitter sourdough. Smoked salmon, two or three lovely pieces, depending on how hungry you are. And then the scrambled eggs, it's almost like a sauce. Chopped chives on the top, and there you go. Smoked salmon, scrambled eggs, method, recipe were in the comments below. There'll be plenty more tips and tricks and recipes just like this.